Good morning, traders. This is Ed Carter with the Trader Vision 2020 Featured Trade Idea. The trade setup and plan for 7 10 18, uh, bright and early Tuesday. Today's featured trade idea will be ENPH, that's N phase energy. If you look at it, it's been trending strong. You can see the long term trend here. I need to roll this up. So, for about a year, it's been on this strong uptrend. Uh, if we then drop down to the daily, we can see that in the last uh, month, has been an even stronger bullish trend. Uh, in this recent pullback, we had a bullish engulfing signal, uh, a few days consolidation and followed up with a trader's best friend, a doji, in this case spinning top type, indecisive day with a gap up, strong bullish day. Uh, that was on Monday. We'll be looking for follow through to break out of this J hook type, uh, looking for some potential support from this level across these highs here uh, to uh, protect our stop. So we'll be looking to enter here uh, higher than yesterday's close, yesterday, or Monday's close, with a stop down here about where the uh, the open was yesterday. Uh, our first target is up here at the uh, 23.6 Fib extension, uh, which is also this 8.27 uh, type of area, matches up with a weekly resistance uh, potential resistance level. Uh, and then a second target up here about 9.55 uh, again matches up pretty tightly to a 61.8 extension and if we were to get a third bite at the apple uh, we would be up here around 10.50 uh, where we have a resistance level again off that weekly so let's put together a trade plan for this Looks like we should have about a month, with three or four weeks anyway, uh, before we need to worry about earnings. Uh, we've got a lot of bullish conditions in our favor. Um, yeah, overall looking pretty nice here. So let's uh, let's plan it out with three exits, but I don't know that we'll get there. Uh, let's say that we've got an entry about uh, 740. need to pick a number and a stop down here about what six uh, seven oh five our first target up here about eight and a quarter second target about nine fifty and that third target if we were to get there about ten forty five that would be a stretch because it's going to be a long-term trade and we'll probably hit earnings before then so let's uh let's see it says we can do 428 shares let's try 400 see where that puts us in terms of this account oh that's funny so let's put that up to 450. Uh, so we're actually going to be risking uh, only three and a quarter percent of the account 157.50 uh, if we are stopped out, uh, if we then sell, uh, well, let's just look at a third at that first target. We're making almost 11.5%, uh, but we're talking here about uh, only $127.5. However, if we sold the whole position at that first target, we would make our goal for the trade. We could pull in 382. Um, that being the case, I'm probably going to go a little bit steeper here at this first target. Let's take 200 off there. Uh, and let's take 150 off at that second target. Which, instead of 2.43 to 1, gives us almost 4 to 1 uh, at that second target. And if we sell the last... 
hundred shares if we were to get to that third target uh, we would then be getting over five to one and again the risk is 157.50 to being stopped out with a chance to make as much as 790 but probably someplace in the five six hundred dollar range if we get that second target um, that uh, I'm going to be banking on this first target and then uh, hoping for this second target uh, I'm not even sure that uh, I'm going to plan it but uh, I'm not even sure I need to worry about this third target just because we don't have a ton of time left so that will be our trade plan for today uh, please evaluate this against your view of the market uh, whether the bulls are now breaking out and in charge again uh, your own trading style and criteria and rules and if you take it I wish you the best of luck uh, either way we wish you the best of luck in the market on Tuesday and we hope to see you in the trading room